yogurt. Welcome back. If you're near, my name is Mas Ingenieri. In this channel, we do lifestyle motherhood and everything in between. So lately, I've been doing a lot of silent vlogs. The recipient is amazing and I'm loving it. Uh, June, June Kira, go check out our channel. Has been 
telling me that I look at myself when I'm really filming and she has said that for such a long time and the temptation is so high of looking at myself but another content creator i don't remember her name quite well in my previous vlog she commented that issue of me looking at myself and right now i'm trying to look at the lenses you guys tell me if you can see the improvement in me today was such an amazing day i was really busy yesterday today i came went for work and I came back early before it started raining because um, I'm very vulnerable like I don't have a very strong uh, health immunity system and I usually get a lot of infections especially chest infections I'm trying to fight that especially in Saizi because it's a rainy season here in Kenya in fact we're experiencing a lot of floods and if you're in Kenya or around East Africa I'm hoping that you're keeping it safe uh, in this vlog I will be just doing my normal days around Nairobi running my small business i thank god for it and i thank you my people everyone who has supported me either encouraging me sending me dms yeah it has been amazing nimekuwa such a busy soul oh thanks to god and my customers yeah so uh, there is nothing much uh, that i'm going to say here i don't want to talk too much and i will just end uh, to shower and then i will see you tomorrow while we are going to work yeah thank you for watching keep locked until the end of the video what time i'm waiting for my uber then we go to work i'm going to make some deliveries then i need to do my nails so let's go let's go <laughs> running around elter skelter in the rain in nairobi so after work i went out a little out it's the, i just went into a local club with my buddies i always pass through that club when coming from work or going it's just along the road the road where i pass through and i walk through there and i'm like i will just come one day and i enter here yeah, i've been meaning to just go out and have some fun guys i want to ask you guys i'm almost done in 30. <laughs> does is this what really adapting entails just being so busy making money or even though you are making little money chasing money so that you can pay bills um nothing uh, you can do about it you're just chasing the bag and you don't you don't get to enjoy life or it's just a mistuation <laughs> is it only me who is feeling like life is moving so fast yes 
I'm very thankful for where I am. Like everything is opening up. Honestly, I can't complain. El Nyari is doing so great. Actually, right now it's like El Nyari is what supports us fully. Uh, it has so much potential. So I decided to concentrate on it and do a little uh, content on the side here and there. But yeah, so is it only me who is always busy working or it is just an, an, a mid-life situation that happens to everyone? If you are watching me and you are maybe in your late 20s, early 30s, how is life treating you? How is everything? Are you okay? Are you busy? Do you, do you have time for yourself? I, I try to intentionally create time for myself, but the kind of business that I operate is very, very, very demanding. I have to be there inspect things because I don't want anything to go wrong right now. Quality is my, the only, I've just learned quality is the only thing that will make me just uh, survive the market and build long lasting relationships, you know, and my business is such a good model because People always keep upgrading their own and if you are going, doing their, for them, good work, they will always choose you. If you are honest, they will, they will always come for you. So that was what was popping. I just felt I need to go out, have one, two or three guaranas. Nile ile nyama ya club ni feel vizuri. It might, it is not even sounding like cute. But that's what I was craving. That's one in a moment situation where I feel like I'm in campus once once again. I'm just uh, having some time for myself. Young to enjoying life with no stress. And that's what I did. So we went out. Uh, it was just so local. It was so local. It was just such a local base. We went out. Uh, we had fun. We laughed. Uh, to a board, what uh, work kunyo one to zao, and I had to come back to my house. I live far, far from where I was, and I it was raining oh, as always crazily. So I got at home around two at in the morning, yeah. So I got at home at two, and everyone was asleep. My manager, house manager, was waiting for me. My baby was. <laughs> asleep the moment i got home you know i could share the bed with that the moment i got home she was like mommy mom i, I felt so 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 guilty for going out uh, and acting like i'm a small girl well she's up somewhere waiting for me yeah that was what happened i enjoyed it and everything felt nice for that moment would i do it again I would, but I don't know what I should do with these uh, hangover situations because they are crazy. They make me lose track of my schedules. I'm not able even to work the way I should after a night of drinking. And my dear, I just took four guaranas. Not like a lot. I'm such a heavy, not a heavy light drinker. Yeah. So I just want to end this vlog. Hope you're enjoying this mini series of glimpse of my life, really. I'm trying to keep up with everything and yeah thanks for always coming back to watch my channel I really do appreciate like a lot a lot till the next one bye